Ladies, gentlemen, my biggest fans, and those who have no sense. I'm considering starting a new series called Brett Keen is so dumb, he said what? Or something like that. I'll, I'll figure it out in the mix because I do all this stuff uh, extemporaneously and um, I'm just kind of flowing with it. But I had a great idea. At first I thought maybe I should try to like debate Brett um, but my chihuahua is not available for that. So I thought maybe, just maybe, I could look on the YouTubes and see what Brett King has said before that would either, you know, make him look like an idiot or confirm he's an idiot or something like that. So ladies and gentlemen, I have found a gold mine when it comes to Brett King is so stupid he said what? Or something like that. So first of all, here we have exhibit number one. Classic Brett. Classic fucking what Brett. What a funny so guy. Are you guys ready oh, for some dry wit? Oh, Brett he's a, a retard. All right. Uh, the military amuses no me and makes behind. no sense. Here is why. <laughs> they won't. Number one. Okay. Number one. <laughs> number one is number one. staggeringly stupid. The, number what? one. Brett is staggeringly they stupid. They won't allow criminals who murder <laughs> to serve our country. <laughs> Boo. Seems like a guy on death row could get medals in no time flat to be promoted to general based on his unique skill set. Yeah, so what Brett wants to take this guy. Killer. Okay, now, Brett Keen is no Christian, ladies and gentlemen, and I just want to prove it. He doesn't even understand the basic distinction between thou shalt not kill, as the old King James says, but actually more accurate. Modern translations say thou shalt not murder. You see, murder is personal. We don't need murderers in the military. That would be an absolutely colossal mistake. We need men of integrity, men that follow orders, men that don't live for themselves and live for their own personal vendettas. Brett, you seem to be a man that's left no friends behind. And you've left a lot of people that don't really like you. I wonder why you're persona non grata in the atheist community and you are no Christian, my friend.